everybody. Happy 2-22-2022. Come on in and say hello. Just posted a couple of videos for 222. Welcome, welcome. Good to see everyone. Two twenty two twenty two. Hello and welcome. Hi, everybody. It's a cold and blustery day here, and we're supposed to be getting snow maybe tomorrow. I'm doing fabulous. I hope everyone else is going fabulous today. On my way, um, I am a volunteer park ranger, and on my way to the well, right before I got there, there was a rainbow in the sky. I didn't get a chance to capture all of it. Ah, uh, hello, Daughter of Gaia. Welcome, welcome. Make sure you're following Daughter of Gaia. Uh, we, we just met, but I love, love her sessions. So, yeah, it's cold out, and we're going to get snow probably tomorrow. Probably tomorrow. Um, we weren't Last week, I was out hiking in short sleeves. So, here we go. Here we go. Welcome, welcome. So for those of you that are new, let me know. It's cold in Northern Ireland. Let me know uh, how you found me. Was it on the FYP? Um, did somebody refer you? I've taken a few days off. I've taken a few days off. So I thought, well, this is 2-22-22. I have to pop on for a bit. I'm going to be, um, hello, Hearing Heaven. Guys, Hearing Heaven has been, gosh, he's on fire. Make sure you are following Hearing Heaven. Give a wave. Give a wave. And Bomber's in the house. Oh, my gosh. All my mods are popping in. Um, so, yeah, I got the rainbow at my sacred place today. You found me from Cody, Hearing Heaven. And Cody's in here. Make sure you guys are following him. Margie is in the house. It was it. We got hail at the well. We got um, some rain. We got some wind. My poor little park ranger hat was trying to fly off of me. <laughs> Made it home safely, though. But what a place to be on 22222. You know, I did a couple of quick videos, one at the well. I did some beautiful a beautiful uh video of the water there and then, you know, the the rainbow. I did a quick video of that. So guys, welcome, welcome. Go see those two videos. For those of you who are new and you don't know what I do, my name is Pam Sears. I'm an evidential psychic medium. I do bring forth details, information from loved ones. That would be possibly uh, some names, some dates, how they crossed, how they lived on earth, how you're doing on earth right now. Uh, possibly how many kids they would have had, what was their career, that type of thing. Um, I do not pick and choose anyone in the chat to give messages, okay? These are all spirit guided. So don't ask me to give you uh, a reading or a message I do my prayers to God before I come on, and I know that those who need to receive a message will receive a message, okay? So you can hold those comments and ask me to give you information because it's not going to happen. In fact, my number three pinned video, my number three pinned video is uh, my life etiquette. So make sure you go and watch that one. It'll give you an idea of what happens when you pop into somebody's live. Um, you don't want to pop in and start immediately yakking and asking for, give me a reading or I need this or I'm desperate. That's just not how my lives work. Okay. But everyone is welcome here. Everyone is welcome unless 
you are here with hate in your heart, with judgment, uh, rudeness, disrespect, name calling, and that is not allowed. Okay, everyone has their own journeys on this earth, and I can certainly honor yours and let you live your life, but I expect the same respect back to me. Okay, now, uh, once again, I have to remind you guys, this is my one and only TikTok. My one and only TikTok. I, hello, Radiant Tarot, Jesse, hello, my sweet. All of my psychic friends and mods, please give a wave. Thank you. Um, so there's a lot of fakes and scammers out there. I'm just here to let you all know that are in the chat right now. Never send a message, a direct message here on TikTok. I will never send you a direct message. Um, no reputable person on here is going to slide into your DMs and give you a message. That are that's the scammers. Don't don't buy into it. Don't give them any personal information, please. Um, all of my social media is in my link, which is in my link tree in my bio here on my page on my TikTok page. Um, follow me on Instagram. Follow me on YouTube. Follow me on Facebook business page. Follow me here if you feel so guided. All of my lives on all of my platforms are free. Always free. Okay. I don't ever charge in my lives. That is a way that I give back in service. Okay. So, um, but on my Instagram, you do have to request to follow. You do have to request to follow. I made it private because there were so many scammers. Oh, and fakes. So you just have to, um, you just have to request to follow me, and I will make sure that you're not one of those. One of those. So welcome. Thank you guys for following me. Oh, guys, thank you for the gifts. All of my lives are free. I don't ever, ever, ever charge for any of my lives. Okay. Um, and one of the things that I also don't talk about, somebody just asked, I don't talk about health questions and I don't talk about pregnancy. That's between you and God. Besides, don't ask me. Um, oh, it's got some more people. Um, I do have private sessions. If people are looking to have a private session with me, you can look that up in my bio. You can send me a message to my website. That's the only way you're going to connect with me and getting a message is through my website sending it direct to my email so um you can send i don't talk about any of pricing or anything in here just send me a message and i'll be more than happy to get back with you okay um so yeah somebody asked me about reincarnation yes i do believe in reincarnation there is no way that we are going to get through all of life lessons in one life um, therefore, you're always going to meet people that you've had in different reincarnations, past loved ones, uh, your kids, you know, you guys have been in lifetimes together, um, even the people that you don't get along with, those two. Um, so anyway, I do believe in that. Let me clear the energy, okay? Guys, don't ask for personal readings, please. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, Beth. Um... I'll think about that. I'll think about doing another giveaway when it happens. I'm not sure. I've got the two that won from my last giveaway. You know, I do like giving back for sure. Um, so anyway, let me clear the energy in the room. Then I'm going to pull a couple of collective cards. Then we're going to see if spirit is popping through. Um, also, pretty soon I will be sending out, uh, I will be giving cards by age groups. So everyone in a particular age group will be receiving a card. So if you guys are still in here when that happens, everyone will get a message, okay? Thank you, Jamie. All right, let's clear the energy. Let me know, first of all, where you feel it. Um, and where you're from. I am in Arizona, Northern Arizona, and I always feel it in my heart. 
What spirit do I communicate with? Um, your guides and angels, your loved ones who have crossed over to the other side. Still going. Yeah, I'm I'm came on I try to come on a little earlier sometimes. I do have a podcast that I'm gonna guest on tonight. So I thought I'd pop on here for just a little bit. There you go, guys. There you go. Let me do a couple of quick announcements. Let me flip the mirror. This is my very own Heart Rock deck that I have designed. I get Heart Rocks in nature and I get messages with them. So what I do is, what I did was I took some of my favorite ones and I've turned them into a Heart Rock Oracle deck, okay? Um, so these are not listed on my website, but you can send me a message saying you're interested in my Heart Rock cards. This is my third edition, and I've added 11 cards to it. So isn't, isn't that exciting? It's exciting to me because I still get hearts out in nature all over the place. All right. Also, my mods are going to make me do this. So here we go. This is, this is my first book, Whispers of the White Dove. The White Dove is my animal totem. Um, inspirational poetry that is on Amazon. Also, Heart of the White Dove, my second book. I'm pretty proud that this one won a, sec a five star award. This one has a few poems, some short stories, some hospice work, and my temporary journey with cancer. I do not claim that journey, it was a temporary journey with cancer. Okay. Um, and one of the reasons I want to talk about this really quick is I put it off and put it off publishing. First of all, I didn't think anyone would be interested in my writing. Second of all, um, I thought to myself, I'll just publish it before I die and leave it to the family and the kids and grandkids. And then the breast cancer hit. Tomorrow's not promised, y'all. Tomorrow's not promised. What is it that you want to do? Go do it. Go, hello, Tyler Renee, my person. Go do it. You want to write a book? Write a book. Tomorrow's not promised. They're both on Amazon. Tomorrow's not promised. You want to write a book? Write a book. You want to move to another country? Move to another country. Okay? Uh, yeah. Life is short. Life is precious. Whoops. Sorry, didn't mean to do that. I have a very loving, close relationship with Jesus. Okay, just in case somebody was asking that or making a comment for that. Yeah, um, God and Jesus. God is my guidance. Always, always, always. Thank you, Tanya. Thank you for that. I really appreciate that. So, guys, that was, um, I'm going to pull, whoop. Yeah, I'm going to pull two collective cards. So everyone is welcome in here, but please be respectful. Please do not be rude. Please do not uh, force your beliefs on anyone else, okay? We all have our own journey to walk with the same destination. And I will stand by that comment forever. We all go to the same place, okay? All right, now I am going to pull two collective cards, one from my very own Heart Rock deck. One from my very own Heart Rock deck. Okay. And I'm going to pull one from the Queen of the Moon Oracle deck. This is a deck that I got from Ziggy Booten for my birthday. I love this deck. Um, and we're going to see what is our, what is our community collective messages. Okay. And if it doesn't resonate with you, that's fine too. I do like to start off all of my lives by clearing the energy and pulling some. Thank you for that. Pulling some cards. All right. So here we go. I don't look, 
I, ooh, right on the bottom, whatever it is. Here we go. Ooh, I like that. Okay, here's the first one. Foundation. Foundation. Look at this beautiful heart rock. Foundation. You have a strong foundation to keep you going. You have a strong foundation to keep you going. King CJ Dukes is in the house. OMG. Foundation. We all have a good foundation to keep us going. Claim it. Now the second one is abundance. This is a day of abundance. This is 2-22-22. Abundance. Claim it. I claim it. I claim it. This is a huge day for manifesting. Huge. That's why I spent it at the well at my sacred place. Abundance. This one says Hunter Moon. Look at all the abundance she has in her life. So, King CJ, if you are still in here, my dear, give a huge wave because he has his jewelry that he designs and makes. He has made me two beautiful necklaces. And, oh my God, the work that he does is fabulous. So, King, please... Give a wave. Make sure you are following them. Also, if there are any of you or anyone that you know that are struggling mentally, in my link tree on my page, there is a link called Code Purple. Thank you, Code Purple. Tyler Renee, who is in the room right now, my beautiful mod, has gotten together and produced uh, code purple that has 195 countries that you can link to to get resources to help you out if there's any form of mental crisis, anything like that. Anything like that, okay? You can find your country, 195 countries. Even if you're a parent and you have small children that need help, those are resources that will help. Okay? Code purple. It's in my link tree. That's on my page. I am proud to be an affiliate. Okay? Perfect. Okay. This is how it's going to go. And thank you guys um, for following me. Um, thank you for sharing out the live. Thank you for tapping the screen. Oh, electric bruja. Thank you for the lovely crane. Um, so, guys... Give me a minute. I want to see if I have a loved one that is coming through. This is what happens when I... Yes, let's all thank Tyler for the hard work that she's put in for that. Thank you, guys. I do I do try to be... I get excited a lot, but I mean, I do try to be calming and helpful and loving and warm. That is, you know, God's asked me to do some work on his behalf. And so I, I love bringing comfort to people and that's why I pop on here I'm probably not gonna go every day okay um you know in fact I took a few days off I just sometimes we have to take a step back so I took a few days off but today's an important day so here I am now if I have a loved one coming through this is the routine you I will write down all the details you must take everything you must Take everything. Oh, of course, today's a perfect day for manifestation. It's 2 22 It's a portal. Manifest. Um, so anyway, so I'm going to write down all the details. I will tell you all the details that this person is giving me. Okay? Um, if you, and you have to take every detail, every detail you have to take. Okay, and because um, if you can only take a couple of things, that's what we call a postcard. A postcard is, I am not directly connecting you with your loved one, but there's many of you that are going to pop into this energy of what I'm doing and do a quick message. A I call it a flyby. 
giving you a message and leaving. Okay, that's that happens. Those are postcards. However, you must take every detail. And if you can take every detail, tell me in one or two comments how you can take all the details. Don't just say, I can take all this. We need to know how you take and how you resonate. Once you figure out who this belongs to, then I am going to ask you for consent and I'm going to ask you to talk to me in all caps, okay? This could very well belong to more than one person. I'm just being open and honest with you guys. A piggyback situation is the universe has got more than one spirit who has passed with similar details, similar names. I don't know how the universe does it. That's their business. Um, and so the, there may be two people in here that have their own individual loved ones, okay? All right, so give me a minute. Thank you guys for following me. Um, excuse me, somebody said I can take all the details. I haven't even, guys, I haven't even tuned in to see if we have a loved one here. So, thank you for the butterflies. I haven't even said anything. All right. So, give me just a moment, okay? Okay, I think I have someone popping in, so just give me a minute, y'all, okay? Um, so yeah, don't just say, hey, I, this is me, I can take it all, because more than likely, it's going to just be a postcard. So, hang on a minute, just breathe, tap the screen if you would like, share out the live, follow me if you feel so guided to do so. Okay. Okay, here we go. You guys, we uh, while I was writing down who this what the spirit was telling me, who's on the other side, we have more people popping in. So, whoo, there's a lot of people in here. Pay attention. Um, make sure that you listen carefully because don't give me one or two things. You've got to take every detail. If this is not your loved one, please don't comment. Please just hold your comments because I'm trying to figure out who this belongs to. Okay? Um, all right. And I have my mods in here. Y'all will be muted. If I ask you to hold your comments and this isn't your loved one and you keep spamming, you will be muted. I'm just saying. I don't want anyone to have to be muted, but I want to find who this belongs to. This is an elderly female who passed from memory issues, okay? So she was older, Alzheimer's, dementia, more than likely it was Alzheimer's. She's showing me sewing, and she's so showing me lots and lots of flowers. Lots and lots of flowers. Okay, so She's talking about four kids, and then she does say two boys, okay? She's showing me skydiving. She's showing me September. She's showing me May. She's showing me the number 11. I have a D-O-R name, so that could be Dorothy, Dory. 
I also see June, which I feel might be somebody's name, but it could be the month of June, but I feel it's somebody's name, and the name Eric as being significant. And for some reason, she's showing me Jackie Gleason and the Honeymooners. Jackie Gleason, and you guys, pay attention. I said, hold until I give all the details. So, Elena, you got to take more. Can you take more? Can you take more, Elena? You've gotten a lot of the details, Elena. Can you take any of the other details? I'm going to write you down as a possibility. If I'm lagging, go out, come back in. Name was Dorothy. I was born in June. Elena, wow, that's pretty fast. Okay, Elena. Please give me consent and talk to me in all caps. Um, I have enough moderators. They don't allow me to do any more moderators, okay? Uh, let's see. Embalmer Granny died with dementia. House was all around September. Is dad's birthday. June is bro's birthday. Um, yeah, guys, go out. Come back in if I'm lagging, okay? Um, Elena. So, Embalmer, this might be for you or it might be postcards, Elena has given consent. Thank you. Okay. What is the honeymooners? I do have someone. I do have someone that has taken all of this. Okay. Lots of postcards for some of y'all. Okay. And you can say thank you to your, don't just say I can take all of this. It doesn't work that way. You have to tell me how you resonate. You got to tell me how you resonate. Mods, is there anyone other than Elena that took everything? I'm lagging. I'm sorry, guys. It, it'll get worse if I put on my Wi-Fi. So we don't want that. Well, you gotta gotta tell me more. There's more details. So mods, is there anyone else? It's possible that this is going to also be for L. I don't know. I know Elena, you took everything. Okay. Um Margie Cass. C A S S. Okay, let's do this. L E L L E. And Cass, can you please give me consent? And then we're going to go further. We're just going to just give this message. You just sold an old VHS, Honeymooners. That's funny. Okay. All right. L has given consent. Cass, if you are still here, please give consent. The rest of you. Okay, Cass. L and Elena, please, the three of you, talk to me in all caps. It looks like we have a piggyback situation. Okay, let me, um, my grandmother used to watch that show. Okay, thank you, L. All right, now, um, oh, she's talking about the skydiving. I have three that I am connecting with. The rest of you guys, can you just hold your comments, sit back. <clears throat> if you feel you're getting postcards from your loved ones, just say thank you, Okay. Just say thank you. Yeah. What's this about the skydiving? One and only? Is there another one, Margie? Okay, if there is one that's called one and only, Margie says you've taken everything, that will be four of you. One, two, three, four. One and only, please give consent. Everyone else, please hold. Yes, Lala. Okay. Lala, please give consent. The one and only, I consent. Thank you. Okay. 
All right, there we go. The skydiving. Did somebody recently go skydiving? Thank you for the consent. Did one of you recently go skydiving? Did she do some skydiving before she passed? I mean, you never know. But the skydiving is very important. And the four of you, talk to me in all caps, please. The ones that I'm giving messages to, those are the ones that I have asked to consent. You made plans to go skydiving. Perfect. That's, she always wanted to. Thank you, one and only. So the... If you made plans to go skydiving, that, that is a validation that she saw what's going on on Earth. I love those kind of validations, okay? That means they do watch we, what we do. They follow us. You know, they're busy on the other side doing their own thing, but they do check in on us, okay? Perfect, okay. Um, was she, okay. All right, here we go. Remember when I said September and May? Now she's saying backwards, May, May, September, May, September. I believe is the May, September, is that the one that they're talking about when you have a big, large age difference? May, September, May, September. Do you guys know that? She's got it backwards now, May, September. Was there a long age gap in between her and her husband? Cassie, your birthday is in September. Okay. Guys, hold your comments. Please let me get this message through and then I will give group cards for everyone that is still in here. Cassie, you met your husband in September. Okay. Is there a big age gap? Because you know that May, September, May, September. Okay, my dad, her son was born in May, her September. Okay, that's fine. She just went backwards. She said September, then May, and then she went May, September. Okay. We have an age group that is large to me. Okay, that's a validation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. All right, lots of validations. Okay, um, was there a recent anniversary of some kind? A recent anniversary. There was a special day, a special anniversary. Okay, you guys have validated that September, May. Thank you. Okay. She passed in February. There's the anniversary. Okay. Because she's talking about the anniversary, the anniversary. Okay. Thank you for validating that. Okay. I'm also show, being shown a bunch of daisies. I, I got shown that a few days ago. Daisies. Daisies. I know because she talked about a whole lot of flowers, lots and lots of flowers, okay? But now she's showing me daisies. So that's a spring flower. The one and only, I used to make daisy chains in her yard. Oh, how cute is that? Your favorite flower is daisy. Okay, thank you. So you guys, so you understand there's four people here with their own individual loved one coming through. That is a piggyback. Don't ask me how the universe does it, but that means four of them are getting their own individual message from their loved one, but everything is similar. It's amazing how the universe works this way. I asked a year ago if they would all, you know, I asked my guides to have them stay in the waiting room, and my guide said, no, this is how it's going to happen. Get used to it. Okay. She would always plant daisies in my mom's garden. Okay. Thank you guys for that. All right. She's talk, talking about something that you're putting up with right now. Putting up with, meaning while well, you're putting up with something. You're putting up with something. Oh, you have a pic she took of you smelling a daisy when you were three. Oh, I just freaking love that. I freaking love that. Okay. You're putting up with something. I don't know which one of this, 
Which one of you this is for? For a change. Time for the change. Whatever that is. Elena, marriage issues. L, there's a few different things I'm putting up with at the moment. Okay, she's saying there's, it's time for a change. Your daughter acting crazy. Okay. Okay, time to make a change. And you, yes, I'll tell her. You already know what that change needs to be. Focus on it. The answer is yes. Whatever you're asking, I, she just said, yes, the answer is yes. The answer is yes. But you already know that. You already know that. Okay? We do need to trust our internal GPS. Okay? You do not have to do the way she did it. Now, I'm assuming, yes, is that correct? Okay. In her day and age, she said, we put up with things. You don't have to put up with that right now. Not in this day and age. You don't have to put up with that. Okay? And trust. You already know what's going on inside of you. The answer is already there. She's just here to give you that support. Okay? All right, let me see. She's also talking about somebody recently passed a course, passed a test, passed a course. Take a deep breath. Just breathe, Al. Just breathe. Did, did, did one of you just pass a course or pass a test? This is what she's talking about. And this is for Cass Elena L. And one and only. Cass, I passed my certification test for my degree. Awesome. The one and only. My son just became a journeyman roofer. Awesome. This is validation that they watch what's going on on earth. You see? My dog always starts on her chew toy. Oh, my God. I think I saw Angry John come in here. Hello, Angry John. I missed everybody in Phoenix. Oh, it's 444. The angels are with us. The angels are with us. Elle, I'm going back to school and need to pass this test. Okay. You got this, she says. You got it, you got it. So for those who just passed the course, you got it. You got it, you got it. So it took you a little time from what I'm hearing, but you got it, you got it. Yeah, it's 444. Yes, I believe in God. God and I communicate every day. I'm in constant communication with God. Okay, so let's see if she's got any other message at the moment. My dog and her squeaky toy. Oh my gosh. Oh, she's always doing that. Okay. I think her basic thing was, um, oh, thank you. Psychic Samantha's in the house as well. Guys, moderator, Psychic Samantha, all my reader friends that are in the room, please give a wave. Please give a wave. Um, let me finish this. You, that's why she, yes, I'll tell her, I'll say it again. That's why she came. To tell you you're putting up with something. Stop. Stop. It's time for a change, she said. Okay? They know what's going on on earth. Okay? That was the main reason for popping in. And at this point in time, I'm going to see if there's anything else. Time to be free is all she says. Time to be free. Time to be free. 
So I want to thank you guys. I will do my best to upload this to my YouTube. It takes a couple of days sometimes because I try to upload and it just takes forever and it says it didn't work. You so I want to thank you guys. I will do my best to upload this to my YouTube. It takes a couple of days sometimes because I try to upload and it just takes forever and it says it didn't work. You got to do it again. I will do my very best to upload this with today's date to my YouTube. Okay? You guys are welcome. You guys are welcome. What I'm going to do right now, I'm going to pull some cards by age groups. Things have settled down in here now, so... Whew, that 1100 was a little bit much. There's still a lot of people. Okay. I'm talking out loud and you're answering all my questions. Point on. Well, thank you. See? Thank your loved one for that. Tic Tac. I have the best mods on Tic Tac. Okay? Tic Tac. I have the best mods on Tic Tac. Okay? And it's, it's such a hard job trying to do this for me and to help in the room. I, Nessa's in the house, all my mods, I love you. Please give another wave. Make sure you're following all my beautiful moderators, okay? And if you guys feel that that was something and that was a loved one bringing you message, just say thank you to your loved one, okay? All right, so here we go. If you are 18 to 30, this is your card. 18. Guys, if it's freezing, go back out, come back in. It's always a tic-tac thing. I don't know what's going on, okay? I'm not going to be on much longer here because there's freezing going on. It's a bad connection, okay? On. It's a bad connection, okay? Um, all right, let me go ahead and do these group messages really quick, okay? If you are 18 to 30, this is your card. 18 to 30, growth. Get ready for growth in your life right now. And this is 2-22-22. Open yourself up. Open yourself up for growth. Open yourself up for growth. There are opportunities coming. When the door is open, I mean, when the door knocks, open it. Because it's an opportunity for growth. Yeah, I think there's a lot of people on TikTok right now. Because it's 2-22-22. All right. For some, hopefully some of you are still, can hear me all right? All right, 31 to 50, here we go. 31 to 50. Waiting for the snow. 31 to 50. Balance. Find a balance. I figured you'd like that for you, Tyler. Balance. Time to balance your life. You're out of balance. 31 to 50, you're out of balance. What's going on? So is there something that you're doing too much of and not enough of something else? Are you working too hard and not playing enough? Are you give, give, giving and not getting anything back? There's a balance here that they're asking you to find. Okay? We should be in balance. So if you're the caregiver, then it's time to let somebody give to you. Claim it, okay? 51 to 70. Here we go. 51 to 70. My age group. Here we go. I don't need your, your ages, guys. I got it. I got it all covered here. 51 to 70. Attraction. Soup, the super moon. Attraction. Oh, that's for me. Hmm attraction so the law of attraction is we receive what we put out if you're always thinking victim mode or you're always thinking oh my god i never get anything never nothing good ever happens to me that's more of what you're going to get but you can attract that which is positive by putting out the positive do you understand that look at all these things this looks like an older, it is, it's an older woman. No, I'm not in that. No, I'm done with that. <laughs> I'm done with that age group. You know that. Attraction. We are in the midst of attracting things to us. I'll claim it. I'll claim it. 71 on up. H.J. Guys. H.J sent me this. Is this beautiful? 
sent me this beautiful deck. Thank you, HJ. Sent me this beautiful deck and another backdrop that at this moment I'm waiting to, I have to still iron it out because it came a little bit wrinkled. I will show it. It is the tree of life and a butterfly. So thank you, HJ, so much for that lovely gift. Guys, I got a gift in the mail today. I don't even know who sent it. It is a beautiful uh, wind chime that has a globe, and it's a solar. I don't know who sent it to me. And I... And it's a solar. I don't know who sent it to me. And I... They weren't fond of sorcerers, and I'm not fond of people who judge. Sorcerer. I have some sorcerer friends, but I'm not one of those. But anyway, fear-based people, fear-based people. 71 on up. Here we go. 71 on up. Self-reflection. It is time for self-reflection. Okay? Yep. Self-reflection. Looking in the mirror. Self-reflection. Is that what I want to do with my life? Is that how I want to live? I think not. Or and then you got to change it. Or self-reflection might be, I'm very proud of where I'm at right now, considering where I came from. Self-reflection. That's a good card. That's a good card. So I guess there's a lot of lagging going on, guys. So what I want to do right now, I'm going to pull a final collective because, um, of course, you know, we are having a storm moving in. So that might be part of this. Okay. Um, however, here we go. I'm going to pull a final card because I do have a podcast that I have to go get ready for. And I want to thank everyone that has come in, everyone who has followed me and shared the live. Guys, go watch my new videos. I did post two videos today about the 2 22 One was just my beautiful rainbow and the other one at the well. And I did a video. So thank you for that, H.A. Thank you for the heart. Okay. Here's, ah, so here we go. It's a good manifesting day. It's also a day to release. Oh, no, this is another friend's podcast that I'm going to be going on to. And I, um, she has a private group that I do uh, mediumship sessions for. So it's a, I think it's private tonight. Sometimes she does them public. Release. Let go of what no longer serves you. Let go of what no longer serves you. Okay? Let it go. Let it go. Just like Frozen is. Oh, John, thank you for that beautiful kitten. Look at that. That must be something new. So I do want to thank everyone, Psychic Samantha Marie, uh, and all my other beautiful mods and all of my psychic friends who are in here. Please give a wave and follow them. Psychic Samantha has been, and oh, now I am peaceful. Nick the medium is also in the house. All of y'all give a wave, please. Uh, follow each and every one of them. Psychic Samantha has been doing more of her spiritual haunting videos, and she's been doing that for a while. Now she's finally going public with it. So go watch some of her videos. And I love each and every one of you. And I know tomorrow is going to be another beautiful day because today a portal opened. Okay. All right. I love y'all. I'll be back soon. Okay. Take care. Bye.